Hello everyone and in this video we will learn about introduction of MS Paint. So uh, in this chapter we will discover the following topics about MS Paint like a paint, tool in the toolbox, shape groups, saving your work and a uh, project is creating a kite. Now MS Paint. Paint or a MS Paint is a colorful drawing program developed by a Microsoft and it is used to draw a color, draw color and edit pictures and a shape. Here are the steps, uh, steps to start paint programs. First click on the start button, then say, click on the window accessory, now click on the paint and the paint program will be in front of you like this. Toolbox and a color box. Paint window contains toolbox and color box. This is our toolbox. Uh, with the help of a toolbox, we can create uh, different different kinds of shapes or we can also fill color with the help of uh, tools or we can also uh, erase our uh, shape and uh, fill color with the help of a true color box. Now, uh, this is our toolbox. Toolbox is the top left side of the paint program. It contains all the tools that you are required to make a drawing. Suppose this is selection if you wanted to select your uh, shape or, or your object or if you wanted to use a pencil uh, with color or a color text if you wanted to change the uh, color of your text uh, or if you wanted to erase your text or your object or color picker and this is our brushes with the help of brushes you can fill the color in your object uh, here are different different kinds of shapes uh, if you wanted to uh, give out outline to your object uh, so use the shape fill outline or a shape fill and you can also decrease or increase your shape size now let's a color box it is the top right side of the paint program and it is used to select the color you want to fill in your drawing. So this is black color, background color and this is for ground color and this is color palette and if you wanted to edit on a, on a different color so use it this edit color feature. Now next is a pencil tool. Pencil tool is used as you are real pencil for your drawing and you can draw straight wavy or a curved line with it. So simply click on the whole ta uh, home tab just uh, first step is click on the home tab and second is uh, click on the pencil tool select pencil tool and so, uh, increase or a uh, decrease in size of your pencil with your choice. This is your uh, pencil tool size box and just uh, click on that and drop down uh, box will be appear and then select your pencil size and then select the width of the line. Step 4 is select the width, width of the line and now uh, the drawing area drag in mouse and start making drawing. Now if you wanted to uh, erase your shape or your object. So erasing tool is just like a real eraser which you use to erase your drawing. So if you wanted to use eraser tool, so just click on the home tab and this is your uh, menu ribbons, menu bar will be appear and then uh, this is your eraser tool, click on that, select it and now uh, go with the uh, size box, eraser size, just click on that and drop down will be appear like this and then select your eraser size or your, your eraser width and now drag it to your, on your drawing in the area to erase the required part of a drawing. Now next is a brushes. Brushes tool is used to uh, show real time paint brushes. So simply click, uh, click on the home tab and then this is your brushes and now uh, click on the size of box. This is your brushes and click on the size of box uh, uh, and then select the width of the brushes. Simply go to the home tab and this is your brushes, uh, different different kinds of brushes are here and then simply click on that and uh, drop down box will be appear and this is, these are the different different uh, size uh, with uh, different different kinds of uh, brushes width. So now and now in the drawing area drag the mouse and start making drawing. 
now let's you can use the shape group in the paint to draw different different types of shape uh, like a rectangle circle triangle oval or a line tool is also there shape a line shape is also there so just go with the home tab and this is the shape group and just select uh, any shape or drag on your work area and now next is a line uh, shape group see this is the line group and this is rectangle uh, tool and this is oval tool so uh, fill color tool if you wanted to if you fill your drawing using fill with the color tool so just go with the file tab this is your home tab and click on the fill with color fill with color is this step 2 is fill with color and then step 3 is a click color click on the color one box and then click on any color from the color palette just select any color of from color palette and then click on the area where you want it to color like uh, this circle is selected and then just uh, go with the home tab and select a uh, pick uh, fill color option and select any kind of color and then just fill in there they fill in that now let's learn polygon tool polygon tool is used to make a shape with any number of sides so just uh, if you wanted to uh, use it so, uh, simply click on the home tab and then uh, go with the polygon tool this click on the polygon tool this type of tool and then click the size uh, increase or decrease size of your choice and then select the width of the line jo uh, jo bhi aapko line uh, width chahiye apne tool ki and then press the left button and drag the mouse see drag uh, press left button and drag the mouse and then release the mouse button to make a line and now click anywhere in a, dra a drawing area uh, click anywhere from the drawing area like uh, this or uh, this or uh, this and a line will be appear attached to a previous line and repeat step 7 until you make a final shape so simply one Uh, uh, drag it and release it. Drag and release it, and then now click the starting point of the shape and ending point of the shape. Now next is a curve tool. If you wanted to draw a curve with the curve tool on your uh, work area, so just uh, go with the home tab and then select the curve tool and then uh, select the size of your tool uh, what uh, thickness uh, would you used and then now drag the mouse on the and make a line and now click on the line and drag to make a curve now next is a you can write a text tool if you wanted to write any text on your uh, work area so just uh, select the text home tab go to the home tab and then uh, second step is click on the text tool and then drag the mouse pointer on the area and text a book will be appear with the cursor and then blinking sign inside and now for uh, step 4 is type your text in the text box now saving your works if you wanted to save your work for for uh, using a future use so just uh, you must save it to side by side for the future use and here the follows these steps to save your drawing just click on the file tab and uh, file menu menu will be appear like this and then say, go with the save option as is or the save as dialog box will works will be appear so uh, uh, the type dialog box will be appear and the type the name of the drawing in the file name text box and then simply click on the save option and now your file will be saved here are the some shortcut key for keys of a as a ms paint uh, control plus n is using for a create a new bl uh, blank page or control plus o is used for a, if you wanted to open a existing file or a existing a uh, document old picture and or control plus s is using for a save your page or save your document now our chapter is completed thank you so much